adult university where we take adult shit and cut it into kid sized pieces. My name is Miss A, and today I'll be sharing with you a homemade natural mouthwash that will make you almost want to throw out your toothbrush and toothpaste. But don't, because I'm no dentist and I'm sure you still need them. With that being said, let's get started, shall we? So before I go into details about the homemade natural mouthwash, let's address the elephant in the room. As you can see, I'm not in the classroom because school is out and summer's in. But adult university is all about life and so there is no vacation or break for adulting. We will continue to have class all summer long. So I hope you'll attend class with me during the summer months. Let's get into the mouthwash. Now I accidentally discovered this, but I think is an amazing, amazing mouthwash. And actually all these ingredients are inexpensive and technically you might even have some of them already at home. And on top of that, individually, these ingredients that I'm gonna share with you are actually used to maintain good to maintain good oral health. So let's Let's get into the ingredients. The first ingredient is baking soda. Now, baking soda, of course, you've seen it added to toothpaste. Um, most Some people can just walk, uh, brush your teeth with it, and so on and so forth. But baking soda is really, really good. And combined with the next two ingredients is an amazing uh, oral health uh, care system that will help you have clean, clean teeth and feel like you want to just throw your toothbrush and toothpaste away. The next ingredient is bentonite clay. Now, bentonite clay has great properties that make it an amazing tool for the face and oral hygiene. So um, you'll definitely want to have some bentonite clay on deck. And also, you might actually find this last one, this last ingredient in your bathroom already. And that is hydrogen peroxide. Now, I accidentally discovered that hydrogen peroxide combined with the other two ingredients makes for a really amazing uh, mouthwash that if you swish it around your mouth for 10 to 15 minutes, will leave your teeth feeling super clean as if you just went to the dentist and got a clean, a professional cleaning done. And it almost makes you wonder after doing so if you should bother to brush your teeth with toothpaste. But again, don't throw out your toothpaste or your toothbrush because I'm no dentist and I'm pretty sure you still need them. I don't have measurements for these particular, um, or this, for this particular mouthwash because in all honesty, I just kind of put it all in my mouth. Um, whatever good amount I think it is adequate. You know, free pouring into my mouth, <laughs> per se. Uh, and then I swish it all around. Um, but whatever you do, I think you'll definitely want to make the baking soda and the bentonite clay, um, if you're going to measure it out, less than the amount of hydrogen peroxide because... Um, the hydrogen peroxide, you want it to be a little bit more so that it can really swish around those ingredients um, and activate them. Again, if you combine all these three together, I'm pretty sure you'll be looking at your toothpaste and, to and toothbrush like, uh, yeah, hit the road. <laughs> um, that's how good of a cleaning uh, it does. Good oral for the mouth. hygiene is important for your health, so make sure you're taking care of your teeth. Well, that's it for today. Just a homemade natural mouthwash that'll make you want to throw out your toothpaste and toothbrush. But don't. Because you're probably going to need them. Thank you for attending class. Go ahead and do your homework by subscribing to this channel, commenting, and thumbs up in this video. My name is Miss A, and until next time, remember, you must be this tall to pay bills.